Good afternoon, everyone. I'm Steve Hensley. First at four, despite last night's rain, forest fires continue to burn in several counties. But police say one man responsible for possibly starting some of those fires in Letcher County is behind bars. WIMT's Lauren Osborne talked with a homeowner who says the flames were just a few feet from his door. I looked out the window and here it came, it was a fire. A forest fire too close for comfort. And opened the door and there the fire was creeping toward the house. Uh, the fire then began to uh, involve several dead trees which posed a danger of falling, causing firefighters to make attempts to contain rather than put out the fire. And like many other fires, police say this one was set on purpose. They say this man, 21-year-old Johnny Mullins, is responsible. So I've done a lot for him. The owner of this house, Terry Braddock, says Mullins occasionally lived with him and he doesn't understand why he would start this fire. The distance between these woods and this home right here is only feet and the homeowner says this isn't the first fire to threaten his home. Officials also tell us they're investigating several other fires that could lead back to Mullins. And the, the thing you don't understand about uh, the, the forest fires, even though here they might not seem that bad, uh, bad things can still come up, but you can lose houses, you can lose lives. Police say Mullins admitted to starting the fire. He is charged with second degree arson. In Letcher County, Lauren Osborne, WIMT Mountain News. We reached out to Johnny Mullins for an interview from jail, but he declined.